Okay, this will be a funny one. Let's see, you'll soon find out. I don't know if it's an A4. It looks, it looks like an A4, but I think it's not quite an A4, but we're not going to bother with uh, fitting the page for this one. I'm going to leave that. I'm just going to set this up. Right. Right, this one's going to be a funny one. Right, we're going to reverse the colours. I wonder if we're going to give it a background colour or if we're going to leave it. But this will be a funny one. Okay. Alright, I wonder if we're going to give it a background colour or not. It's very, it's quite a colourful piece, which is nice. I like colourful originals. So I wonder what kind of hue we're going to give it. If we're going to give it a hue, we're going to cancel it. We're not doing it. We're just going to do that. Just set this silly thing up. And background colour, we're just going to leave that out. Well, what have we got? It's pretty close to home. It is... Hit the Right Note by the company that I got the photocopier off, Mytronics. They're the ones that have got my service agreement. So they've, they've been doing me really well for over, how long? Nearly five years. I've had these guys uh, look after me with my photocopying needs. And they do very well. And this was one of the things that I got in my welcome pack for this brand new machine. And this is, this is a catalogue of other products as well as um, photocopiers. I might just leave it open just like that. It's quite a thick booklet. I think it's a bit bigger than an A4 as I thought. I think they would have perf they would have used A4 but anyway. <laughs> there you go, stabilizing image. This is normal Konica Minolta self-maintenance behavior. So that's just normal. Now it's ready to go. A lot of people probably would get a fright thinking what, what the fuck is wrong. It sounds like it's wrong, but it's just part of the photocopier. I don't know why it does it. I've never worked on Konica Minolta equipment. I haven't been a photocopier technician since uh, July 2000, uh, 1990, uh, 1997. So it's been more than 20 years since I was a technician. But I think we might need a background colour to make that white area look good. But that looks quite colourful. But yeah, it's an interesting industry to work in. I, I'd like to join it one day, and one day I will. <laughs> one day I'll get, get to it. But let's see what we can do to improve, to improve this. So we're just going to give it a background colour. Uh, red, no, yellow. Uh, what are we going to give it? We're going to give it yellow or we're going to give it pumpkin we're going to make it pumpkin i think pumpkin might turn out nice for the white areas that are left over so here we go it is smaller than a4 so let's see how we go but i recommend these guys if if you want to get a photocopier it's best to do if you want conicum and alter equipment it's good to go through these guys instead of going straight through Konica Minolta because Konica Minolta can be real assholes, money fuckers. So it's good if these guys do all the business liaison with Konica. It's much better that way. Otherwise, you, you know, Konica Minolta will try and twist your arm and and try to pr provide shitty service. I've, I've never had that experience for myself. Uh... But basically, I've, I read a review about it and there was an unhappy customer talking about how nasty they can be. So I don't trust them because they're, big, they're a big multinational uh, corporation. And I'd rather Mytronics do the, the work with them. I'd rather not have Konig and Minolta do the servicing and, and the shit like that. Let's see how we go. Okay, Let's see if we've improved the colour. It looks a bit. Let's hope the hue has made this one look even better. So 
let's see how it goes. Okay, that looks a bit yucky. That looks really yucky, that orange. I was hoping it looks like the... In some ways, the, the, those look better, but I think, yeah, I think the cold hue doesn't go well with this. It looks a bit brown, like yuck. It's like yucky brown. Uh, I think we're going to get rid of that yucky brown. Let's see if we can do something about it. Let's try the hue in a different place, maybe. So we're going to going to hit it up slightly warm and see if warming it up will make it even nicer. So let's see how we go. Here it goes. Here goes our scanner. Cross like so. And we're going to hit that. This is the three-step Konica Minolta product. I mean procedure to make a photocopy why they made it like this i don't know but clinic and alter oh that looks interesting it looks a bit i don't know whether i like the red looks good but the colors look a bit blended sort of but i think we can just call it quits gotta go oh i didn't push the button properly so i'm wondering if we can just compare the three results so there's our I think maybe, it's hard to tell, but it's sort of a toss up between that one and that one. In some ways I like that one better, the red is a bit nicer. So I think we can, we can call that one the best one, so we'll just, we'll just show it off. Uh, we'll show it off the, the right way, so we'll just show off this one again. So there, I think that's the better one.